Well guys, just a quick video. Um, I'll upload a couple more later because I know there's definitely going to be a couple of you that are as excited as I am. Uh, but I'm going to do an updated shop tour. Um, I've still got this. The Devil's Toothbrush. Um, couldn't live without this now. I will eventually get a Fordham um, that's, you know, better voltage hold. You know what they are, don't you? If you don't, you'll find out. Ah, uh, the humble 1x30. Don't think I could ever part with this now, even though I've got that. Look how quiet that is. I've got no safety goggles on, so I'm not going to grind anything as of yet. Oh, the electronic readout. It did come with a load of guards on. Um, I've left that one on, but I've taken the rest off. Um, I think I'll probably be the only person in the world that uses them. And they look like they're going to be a pain in the ass anyway. Bolted it to a piece of plywood, bolted the plywood to a table. The table's solid as a rock. Um, set everything up using bevel box. So it should, in theory, be good to go. I mean, I'll probably end up fine tuning it. But there you go. But there's more. Obviously, my bandsaw, my old color drill. Now I've got this set up here. I'm going to put a Scotch Bright wheel on there because that's not really usable. Um, flat plate. Obviously that, which I don't think there's much life left in this, but when it goes, I'll get a bigger one and upgrade it. Oh, where did the mill come from? <laughs> got a mill. Big pillar drill. Still need to get a dedicated sand stand for that. Still a bit high but then again it's not too bad. There you go. I'll um gotta go to the post office, drop some stuff off. As soon as I'm back we'll get this fired up. And we'll make something.